Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the six. So we're just gonna see what comes up. What do we have for around the six? Hair font. So this is about commitment. So the day is gonna be focusing around a commitment. be dealing with a Taurus breaking free perhaps thinking about breaking free reevaluating a commitment wondering if you want to be single action is needed we have somebody here that is thinking about becoming single by the looks of things or they're thinking about getting in a commitment getting married marriage perhaps a hair font is all about marriage So the Nine of Pentacles reversed. That's a need to take action. Need for discipline. King of Wands reversed. So fear or lack of confidence, lack of self-esteem. This is reevaluating an obstacle needs to be removed. An obstacle of fear. An obstacle of fear that needs to be removed. We could also have somebody here that is trapped. They're in a situation that they are tied to, that they need to break free from, need to find the courage to do so. Somebody needs to find the courage to do so, to break free. Seven of Pentacles, reverse. Now there's some sort of lack of growth, lack of investment. This is unrealistic. There's something that isn't growing. Somebody may have tried to make something work, but it's just not happening. There may be a relocation in the future. Ace of Swords. Now, this is communication, taking a new approach, seeing things clearly, accepting the truth. So somebody is seeing something differently. They're seeing, they're coming up with a new idea, or they're seeing something differently after they've been in a commitment. So I see this is either about, well, I think it's removing yourself from something with the Eight of Swords reverse. Somebody is, you know, they're struggling by the looks of things. They've invested in something that isn't working out. This could be angry. We also have an individual that is looking at an independent person. They're looking at an independent person and they're they're thinking, they're thinking about what their next move should be. This one probably won't be single for long. Probably going to be getting into a commitment. I don't know. About that. Anyhow, Eight of Swords reversed. An obstacle of fear being removed. Somebody may be getting into a commitment. <laughs> yeah, this is opening up. Opening up. Somebody's going to be opening up. And letting go of their fear. They're going to be letting go, opening up, relaxing a little bit, communicating. Okay, let's get the sword of communication, the sword of truth, and the sword of power. So somebody has the power right now. They have the power right in their hands. This is a new beginning. It's a gift. Somebody is being given a gift. It's the gift of clarity, right? They're being given a gift. It's time to let go of some sort of stubbornness before. Perhaps, maybe somebody's been really stubborn, you know. Mm. King of Swords. Now, this is somebody who knows what they want and, and goes for it. This is an individual that is very sharp, very intelligent. Uh, this person has some sort of obviously some clarity or some information or some news or some sort of they see the truth they know the truth they're going to do something because the king of swords is given to do it it's like they know what they want and they're going to do it somebody's going to do something
they're being guided to because this is the guidance this is a gut okay there's a gut here somebody is being guided to do something we also I'm going to change the story a little bit we have somebody here that is very unstable they are unstable they are insecure and they are angry and they may be doing something so that's for somebody else This is a plan. This is coming up up with a plan. Or somebody already had they're gonna be taking action on the plan. This is clarity. It absolutely is. This is seeing very, very clearly. This is uh, exposure. It's seeing the truth. There's been a blocking. Somebody has been blocking the truth. They've been blocking their emotions. They've been letting fear get in the way. This is removing that fear, stepping into unknown territory. It's standing up. It's doing something. Okay, it's doing something about it. Somebody's about to do something. Okay, they're about to do something. They're letting go of their fear. Absolutely. They've been fearful and they're probably, I feel like there's anger here as well. There is a higher power involved because the Hierophant is here. So that is a higher power. This guy is a thinker. So somebody has been thinking about something a lot. They've been thinking about giving something perhaps maybe communication or the truth okay this is taking a new approach this is an awakening of some sort Ooh, unexpected choice in love so this is a choice between two people there's a choice. This is a, this is a strong connection. This is a soulmate connection or a perfect match. Okay, we have a perfect match here. This is a opportunity for love. This is a new opportunity for love. Okay, so we do have a connection here, a strong connection. You know, this is a this is like a, an alignment of something. Two people that are very much aligned with each other coming together. It's a soulmate situation here. I think somebody has let fear get in the way, but it's very clear that this is a strong connection. So there's going to be some sort of union by the looks of things. I mean, the lovers is a union. Definitely communication with a lover. Communication with a lover. Opening up, letting go of the stubbornness, just doing it. I feel like there's going to be a conversation that is had with a soulmate. Okay, I think it's gonna be a it's gonna be a conversation that may uh, really be a surprise. It may be a shock because we get the Knight of Swords on the bottom. It it could be a shock. This is a sudden arrival of some sort. There could be a sudden arrival, or there could be some shocking news that is coming through. This is speaking. This is this is this is a very very talkative. It's it's uh, things happening really really fast. Putting plans in action. Somebody's going to be putting some plans in action. They're going somewhere. They're going towards some sort of connection, and they're moving very very. This is fast moving energy. This is somebody who wants to be ahead of the rest. This is somebody who doesn't, it's like they know what they want again and they absolutely go for it.
So I feel on this day there's going to be some sort of, well, this is an unexpected choice and, or an unexpected opportunity for love, okay? That comes, I feel like it comes out of nowhere. Aces are new beginnings, so we have a new beginning here. We do have a new beginning. Somebody's about to open up. They've thought about it already. They've already thought, they've thought about it a lot. They've been blocking their emotions because of fear. Now the obstacle of fear is being removed. They're going to go in it with faith. They're going to go after it with faith because the Hierophant is all about faith. So I do believe that we have an we have an independent person that may be getting in some sort of commitment or they may be meeting somebody. It could happen very suddenly. It or we could have somebody that is in a commitment that is becoming single because they have somebody else. I mean, I'm just being honest with you here. There's an unexpected choice of love between two people that are probably very much on the same level. These people are on the same level. They have this, they have a lot in common. There could also be some exposure as well. We could, I'm going to change this. I don't know if I already changed the story or not. I do this so many times. I do so many readings that I forget them so fast. But I, I feel like there is somebody here that is angry and they've been blocking their emotions and they could do something hasty, you know, because I said with the Knight of uh, Swords, they could do something hasty. And, and, you know, there could be some law that gets involved. Okay, because the King of Swords could have something to do with the law. So the law could get involved. This is exposure of the truth, you know, and this is accepting the truth, seeing the truth. It's, you know, seeing something very clearly. So something is going to be seen very clearly on this day, put it that way. Six of Swords reverse. So this is trouble. I wonder if I, it is trouble. This is trouble. Somebody may be causing some trouble. Okay, just saying there could be some trouble on this day. Some sort of it could there could be some sort of uh, stormy weather. Put it that way. There could be some waves. Somebody could be making some waves on this day. Uh, we could have somebody that uh, is trying to cause trouble. I hope that is not the case because you know the law could get involved. So if somebody is trying to cause trouble, you know, King of Swords can represent uh, legalities, news of legalities. So, and for if that person that is trying to cause trouble, this could be jail. Somebody could end up in jail because of they're angry. They can't mask this. This is anger. The King of Wands reverse is somebody that is angry and upset and could have, you know, rage. You know, I hopefully that's not the case, but. Anyhow, um, there is some sort of protection here, though, with the Hierophant. Okay, there's a higher power that is involved that may be, you know, protecting somebody. We can only hope and pray that that is the case. Um, and the King of Swords is a protector. This is a protector. So there is some sort of protection here. There may be a protector, somebody that is a protector that is coming in, that is coming into the picture. Anyhow, I feel on this day that there's a higher power involved, for sure, with that Hierophant card, that is uh, 
you know, it's the lovers is 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 two people. It's bring it's bringing somebody a choice. It's it's helping the higher power is is uh, giving because this is giving somebody a choice. This is giving the four of pentacles reverse. That's giving somebody a choice. We're giving somebody a choice. Right now. Because this is this definitely right now. This is a card of consequences as well. This lover's card is a card of consequences. So the choice, the choice is do it now. Because this is about do it now. Or let go. Because this is letting go. Hmm. So anyway, this is an unexpected choice that is coming into the picture on this day. Okay? It comes out of nowhere. There could be some, some communication that is going back and forth. There may or may not be. There's probably, there could be two people. There could be communication with two people going back and forth. You know, there's a choice. Which one do you want? So I do feel like this is a choice. Somebody's making a choice between two people. Okay, or two options. If it's not lovers, it could be two other options. But this is about commitment. Okay, and there could be falling in love as well with the lovers card. You know, there could be opening up. It could be falling in love. There, you know, something is happening here. Who knows? But this looks like trouble to me. <laughs> it does with the six of swords reverse. That's tr I mean, that's trouble. That's trouble. Um, but you know, maybe we have underneath it. This is refusing to take a new approach. This is blocking emotions, fear. You know, there's an opportunity to get to a better place to have peace and harmony if you can face your fears. We could go all day, but I have to go finish cooking dinner. So good luck.